So I think we found the downtown Bilbao. Oh. Shivari Palace? Shivari Palace. Plaza de. Plaza de Oda. Okay, so we found a place, a pizza place. Me and Bespin wanted to eat pizza. Casa Leoda. And this is the inside of the restaurant. <laughs> Where's Madison? What is she eating? You're like, Margarita? No. Yeah, like turned up to like okay, I'll see you later. See you later. Okay, bye. Have fun at work. Pretty, this was a pretty neat area. Like this was a very good choice. We're discussing our tomorrow's our last day here in Bilbao, and we're going to the museum. We won't have TVs or Wi-Fi for a week. No television for a week. What? We are so serious. I just want to know is it good. So we got our food. Chantel got like what they call a Spanish omelet. So good. Egg and cheese. I love and it. Potatoes. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're at the Guggen, the Guggenheim Museum. So the Guggenheim Museum is an art museum. It was actually built to improve the economy of Bilbao. It used to be just an industrial um, community, industrial town, and um, the government wanted to improve the tourism and stuff here, so they um, contracted with this uh, architect. Uh, I'll have to put his name down on the screen. Um, but he's an architect from LA, born in Canada. He made he made one in New York and uh, a Guggenheim Museum in New York for art. And um, so now this is the second one he's done. He's done it here in Spain, 1997. As you can see, that this is the older um, older part of the of the town with the industrial. But now you have other pieces of architecture that are. Okay, here we go to the museum. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so we've already bought our tickets. Online tickets go this way. So we were told when we were about to go in that James has to leave his electronic bag because it's too big, but we are able to keep our purses and we gotta take the stick off our GoPro. We made it. Madison is our fearless leader. Oh, fearless leader. You are so good. What is this? Well, we're going on the other side of the matrix, y'all. What's it like over there, Madison? What's it like on that side? It's blue. Okay, I'm gonna cross. Here I go. We got to see the film um, activity center. That was really interesting. And it basically just was showing how different lights can manipulate different scenes, creating tunnels or smoke scenes. Um, here at the Guggenheim Museum, they have a cool app that you can download. You put your earbud in and you kind of get a private tour through your ear as you're walking through. I just got sliced, slightly turned around. That's it. So we were in this kind of maze, like really cool architecture, and they have a small virgin replica 
that you can look at in this little room. So this looks like textured art. Wonderful view, isn't it? So we are doing a beach evening. Beach, 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 beach. Okay. So we've been at the museum all day and it's our last night in Bilbao. So we decided to come spend a couple hours at the beach before sunset. No, no. So that was a really nice time. This beach is so pretty and I love how everybody's so family oriented and just playing. <laughs> she loves the sand. <laughs> Pretty cool, they have a, a little restaurant there. It says like burgers, hot dogs, drinks, fries. A little ice cream cones, like packaged ones. Pretty neat area. They're doing like a skateboarding competition or something. So we stopped at this place right here. And they have what looks like a track. Okay, so we drove to this little town and we found a parking spot and I'm gonna be a pro at parallel parking. It's not easy, uh, but it's called Tacos, but it's spelled T-A-K-K-O-S, almost like a Greek spelling. Okay, so we got what they call um, Kikos. They're called Kikos, but they're actually um, what we would call empanadas. This is very good. 